<laughs> What's up everybody? Today we are back at Bush Gardens. If you can't tell, we got Iron Gwazi behind us. You know, every time I walk in the park, I think, well, today's gonna be the day they're doing it a soft open. But <laughs> once again, it didn't happen. Yeah, I think the day that it actually is going to open would be a good, a good indicator would be icebreaker opening. True, very, very true. Today, we're going to do something that we haven't done before here at Bush Gardens. They have like a truck safari <laughs> through the Serengeti. It's only a 30 minute experience, but you do get to drive through the Serengeti and get a little closer than you do on the normal train ride. We're gonna walk through the parks. I'm sure we're gonna get some food at some point, ride a couple of rides. Feed the birds. Feed the birds. We're gonna go feed the birds. That's where we're going right now. You know, last time Tally and I were here, we got to go into the aviary and see all the birds. Jen wasn't with us at, at that time. She joined us later. So we're gonna go straight there. We're gonna go feed some birds. Let's go. <laughs> So we already had Mardi Gras here at Bush Gardens this year, and uh, looks like we got Bush Garden Summer Nights coming up. I'm not really sure what that is. I guess it's just some night events. That'll be fun. So we'll definitely have to come for that. Then Beer Fest last year. We were here for Beer Fest last year, but we actually never came for the actual event because it was on the weekends. Food and wine, definitely, definitely, definitely coming for Hallow Scream this year. And then I, I read about the Guy Harvey weekend. Guy Harvey was actually here recently autographing some merchandise. We missed that one. And then uh, we have a video from last year's Christmas Town. I'm sure we'll be back for that one. Also, if you haven't been watching any recent Central Florida park videos or any of my park videos, I wanted to address the elephant <laughs> in the room. You might notice that there's something missing. What you can could see it? Our what could it? <laughs> no face mask required at Bush Gardens. Just like SeaWorld, official rules state that if you're fully vaccinated, then uh, you are free to go. But if you have not been vaccinated, they are asking you to continue wearing a face mask. Um, it is on the honor system, though. So uh, we we just got here. I would say right now, just looking around, I'd say maybe ten percent. Yeah, ten twenty percent maybe are wearing masks, but everybody else is. Breathing in the fresh air. Whoa. Oh, we got a, we got a loose bird. Loose birds. Yeah, there's a couple of them. Oh, all right. Interesting. Onward. What are you doing? What are you doing? Let go. There's people. Come on. You can do it. Mm. Like, can I make it over there? There he Whoa. is. What's up, dude? You think I got some food, don't you? I wish I did. If I had some, I'd give it to you. I don't think they're gonna let us on the little spinny egg ride. <laughs> <laughs> There's people who go, oh, I'm getting on the egg ride. I think we exceed the uh, weight limit. <laughs> over here they, they like my nectar better no i don't blame them <laughs> okay boys <laughs> thirsty all right come on come on you got to do this for everybody Oh, good job. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. There you go. 
Yeah. I was like, um, they're not soft. No. At all. Yeah, they don't like each other. Well, um, hi. <laughs> How are you? Your friend around with you? Yeah, he just wants to hang out. What's your name? Huh? What's your name? Well, he's like, my name is getting full. That's what my name is. Alright, come on. There you go. There you go. Ow! Don't bite me. Ow! He's like biting me. Whoa! <laughs> hey. What are you doing back there? <laughs> All right. All right. It's time to go. Good boy. Yeah, yeah. This is my little friend. What is your name? All right. Go. Go. She's like, if you don't give me that food back. I'm just gonna take you home with me, is that okay? Alright, what are you gonna do? You're gonna go back up here to the shoulder? If I'm telling you, you better not poop on me. Oh, look at this little guy. I wanna feed this little guy. Yeah, well now I got the food. Now I can go there. Oh, you got food. Good. No. I wanna feed this little dude. Little guy over here looks like he doesn't ever get fed. There you go, buddy. Hey. Go. No, sir. Go. Hey. There you go, buddy. Hey, good boy. Hey, good boy. Our girl. Okay, I'll back off. The last of it. No, nope. that's it. That's all. That's it. That's I'm sorry, that's all. Yeah, that's all. I know. Okay. What did you think about the bird feeding? Um, I, I mean, it was fun. So, what was that? It was six dollars for the little cup of nectar. Yeah, yeah, so six dollars each. Yeah. So, and you do get a pass holder discount if you're our pass holder. Correct. Um, so I think it was nine dollars for two cups. Nine oh three with tax. So that was enough for us to both feed the birds for ten minutes. I'd highly recommend that experience. Obviously, you don't have to buy anything. I mean, you can still go in there and just enjoy the birds, but very inexpensive to, to be able to go in there and feed them. Excited. She's just not showing it currently.
was awesome. What do you think? She loved it. She loved it. So let's do it again. Holding out for front row again, huh? You are. I'm doing what? Holding out for front row. Where are we at? Tigris. You're excited about front row, aren't you? No. Yeah. <laughs> no. got there Jen. It used to be ice cream. Yeah it's like melting. <laughs> and then I got a um, funnel cake with some of Jen's whipped cream on top because she didn't want it. We've we've made it to our safari waiting area yes. and we're waiting. Why are we being quiet? I don't know. Oh okay. Oh, they, they just, we're not disturbing people. Yes. Gotcha. And in other news. <laughs> Right off of the safari, what was your impression? It was a lot of fun. I've gone on enough of like different safari type things and then been told a lot of information. So, you know, the questions that they asked and stuff was things that I was, I was familiar with. There's a lot of people that don't know those answers or, you know, the answers to the questions. And that was interesting. It was interactive. We fed giraffe. I think we talked about it earlier. There's a cost associated with it. Yes. What, $40? Yeah, roughly. It, um, you do get a discount as uh, annual pass holders. I think it cost us, it was like $73 with our discount. So, so it's almost exactly. I looked at my watch and we left and, and we were back exactly uh, on the half hour. So yeah. it was a 30 minute round trip. They, they mentioned that it was hot out there and, and they were not lying. It is um, hot. You're in direct sun the entire time. You're staying the entire time. If you're somebody who has mobility issues, it's definitely not the way to go because you've got to hold on um, and stand. Um, on a moving truck. On a moving truck. But if that's not an issue for you, that was a, that was a fun thing. I'm not sure that uh, I'll be in a rush to do it again, but maybe one day just to see if it's changed. If, if they get some new animals at some point. I don't necessarily know if that would be one that I would take and do again. I mean, like I said, it's definitely great for like kids. They get to interact with the giraffes. And so that, that would be definitely a good one for kids. I would like to do like an ambassador one, to be right. honest with you. It, they, it is expensive, but if we got a discount on it. Uh, and we do, I think they're $250 per person. Another uh, four hour sort of behind the scenes. You can pick the animal that you want to focus on. I think I, I did price it out after the discount. It was like 225 or 200 uh, for pass holders. Yeah. But um, we'll uh, we'll save that for another day. For sure. I 
personally, animals are like my my thing. So roller coasters are his, animals are mine. So we got the best of both worlds, you know, in a couple of our parks. There you go. Well, that is the end of yet another day here at Bush Gardens. What do you think, Chip? Yeah. I mean, overall, I mean, I, we got to do the best of both worlds. We got to ride some rides. We got to, you know, interact with animals and see them. And yeah. So uh, what will we do today? We did um, we did Shikra, mm -hmm. we did Tigress, we did Cheetah Hunt, yes. we did Cobra's Curse, yes. and uh, did the behind the scenes safari tour, saw some animals, had a funnel cake. Fed some birds. Fed some birds. Man, that's a full day. We spent uh, five hours? almost five hours of fun as always. It's, like I have not run out of things to do here yet. There's plenty to do. I see something every time we come. You know, seeing all the birds is, is for both of us is sort of a treat. Seeing the two cans and and feeding the lorikeets today and yeah. um, always a fun experience. So we love it here. We'll keep coming as, as often as we can, and especially once I hear a well an inkling of a rumor that Iron Gwazi is opening. I'm 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 gonna be here. Make a trip. <laughs> yeah, we're coming. So anyway, guys, thank you as always for coming along. If never lost, then never found. So go get lost.